good morning friends in this video tutorial i'm going to explain you how to create a menu bar or menus in your wordpress website right now i will explain here how to create a horizontal menu in the later on tutorial i would also explain how to create vertical menus so this video tutorial will contain uh, how to create new menu horizontal or how to edit or how to delete this menu so what to do is uh, just uh, go to your website <coughs> <coughs> log into your backend. Hmm. I have already logged in. This is my dashboard. Go to appearance section. <coughs> if you reach your appearance section, you will find there an option called uh, sub menu or menus. Uh, and click here menus. Okay, so basically, WordPress website. Uh, if you had used a theme or template it depends upon the theme or template how many menus does it have um, some themes or template have two menus top menus and bottom menus. some have only one okay <coughs> some have none so you need to create that or uh, by own. so we'll go and go from scratch so leave these all things uh, we will it will be automatically deleted we'll create a fresh new menu so uh, once you go to your appearance and uh, menus you will reach to this screen create a top menu suppose i want to use this menu uh, place by my own custom menu so i would write here my top top menu t o p m e n u for my understanding whatever you wish you can write <coughs> click on create a menu create menu after that uh, it will be created hmm. once uh, the menu will be created you would have an option here links click on links once you click on link you will find here home button uh, um, the text which you want to keep on the menu bar first would be home button and for the home button usually the address is uh, the website address so I would click here the URL would be this one and click add to menu it will come under the category of top menu bar so I want to add some more about us suppose uh, a b o u t u s okay so we can't keep the address of about us the same because it is a different place uh, a page so we need to create a page okay so for that purpose go to pages and add new pages hmm. <coughs> when you <coughs> go to that place you'll find here a new page just create a page by um, the name of what you wish a b t about us okay after that uh, choose uh, the template full width template because uh, default template is not complete for the inner place, uh, pages uh, in the website it's uh, good to use full width uh, template without sidebar and publish it once you publish it <coughs> <coughs> the page is now published now click on view page in a new window if you would click on view page you would see the page has been created so uh, now copy this address of your viewed page address not this editor one copy the address of this page which URL and place it here and ok and add to menu <coughs> <coughs> similarly if you want something else uh, like uh, services or whatever would, you can do like the same <coughs> and just save the menu ok once you save the menu it's not like that that you would be able to see your menu okay because you won't see because of the reason that you had not selected the position so go to manage location <coughs> of a <your> menu <coughs> so if you want to keep uh, your or uh, top menu which you had created at primary position you will select here the top menu and save changes click once you click on save changes <coughs> and do the refresh you would see that your menu 
which you have just created will come here hmm. okay suppose you want to use this menu as well secondary menu then what to do <coughs> go to edit menus and uh, type here cre create a new menu click on create a new menu and name it's a bottom menu or whatever you wish b o w t o m m e and your menu create it once you create it add some buttons on the menu suppose uh, whatever you wish home if you home, click the home and do the same thing which you have done and add to menu suppose i want here to keep another other menu called services s e r v i c e s <coughs> just if uh, similarly you create a page hmm, page of services new page named as services services and just uh, select the template and uh, publish it once you publish it view the page and uh, when the page is ready copy the url of that viewed page and uh, place it to this place okay and add to menu okay this uh, bottom menu has also two you can similarly add lot much which whatever you wish if you want to delete such those menus or edit you can click here and uh, remove here or whatever you wish to do so <coughs> still when you reach uh, to your website you will find that your menu is still not appearing there for at the place of bottom anyway because it's not appearing because you have not selected the position now select the position of your second menu <coughs> so bottom menu select bottom menu here secondary position save changes once you do this you would and uh, do a refresh you will find here your secondary menu as well okay suppose you want only one menu then what to do uh, suppose you want to sell, uh, don't use uh, this menu you want only this menu so you whatever the menu item which you have in the uh, primary menu or top menu just delete it okay go to edit menu select your uh, menu here which you want to edit <coughs> Uh, top menu I want to remove top menu so uh, click here select top menu I want to edit so uh, there are two this I would remove it okay I would remove it and save it how now when I would refresh my page I will find that this two menu would be vanished okay so that's fine so the guys and girls this is the way how you can uh, create your menus and edit uh, and do uh, your menu work suppose you want to create a sub menu then how to do this let's see if you want to create a sub menu i will show in the next tutorial So guys, thanks a lot for watching.